Hi everyone, welcome to a quick question and answer session about a wonderful new town event called Norfolk Carols. And I have one of the organizers with me, Lisa Noak. Hi Jill. Hi, welcome. Um, so th we're just, this is a little FAQ session, a couple minutes to inform the community, the, the Norfolk community about our new event, the Community Sing. So go ahead, let's hear about Norfolk Carols. Sure, so the genesis of this event is um, from Kay Doyle, one of our Norfolkians. Yeah. And she uh, grew up in Basking Ridge, New Jersey, where they have this tradition of coming to their center of town on Christmas Eve. It's, they've been doing it for 90 years, and there's over a thousand people that come. Wow. And so it was always something very special in her life. And she thought, let's bring it to Norfolk and replicate it. So last year, uh, she brought together a group and we had the event. So, so this is year two. This is year two. Okay, and we're, we're calling it the second annual <laughs> Norfolk Carols. Um, and it's this coming Saturday. So it's coming up soon, um, Saturday, December 16th, 16th at 5 p.m. 5 p.m. So just a little bit about what to expect yes. from the event. So Great. it is a community sing. It is not a performance. But then saying that, it doesn't mean you have to come and sing. You can also mm -hmm. come and just enjoy the music. We have a volunteer band made up of King Philip um, middle school and high school kids and Zavarian Brothers as well. Uh, that is led by another town volunteer, uh, Buddy Jaworski, and he has conducted rehearsals with that group. And then on the other side, we have a vocal leaders group and this group is just getting together to kind of familiarize with the music so that they can be part of the group and really sing loudly and encourage everyone who <laughs> might not be ready yeah, to sing they out. They can be um, the singing be their, leaders. Exactly. Yes. And that that's group funny. has partnered with Ivy Music. And oh, okay. so that's been a nice partnership and we have rehearsed there. Uh, and then third, we have this year something very special, and that is Gavin Lynn, who lives in town, has uh, composed a, in, a new piece of music for Christmas. And an original. An original. So okay. this will be a world premiere. And <laughs> From we, another, yet another talented Norfolkian. <laughs> yes. And so, and we have, or he has put together a children's choir from Freeman, oh. and they have been rehearsing. Uh, in fact, they're rehearsing their last rehearsal tonight. And so in the middle of the carols event, they will perform okay. their piece, which um, you're all going to love because I've heard it. Great. Yeah. Oh, good. Okay, so there'll be that quick performance in the middle. Yes. But otherwise, other than that new song, the rest of the, the the event will be the community singing together. Yes. And you can sing loud, you can sing soft, or you can listen. hum or listen. Yes. <laughs> and so we will have last year, for those that have been to the event, we uh, sold carol books. This year, like uh, as in the lyrics, in, in the, the lyrics, music, yeah. so that you'll have a songbook to follow along. Mm -hmm. This year, they're going to be free at the event, and so we're really lucky because we had sponsors, and you will see that when you get your book mm -hmm. this Saturday. And then, um, so it's a free event, which is nice. So you don't find a lot of those. Right. And then, in addition, we are selling at the event uh, a coral uh, Norfolk Carols ornament, ornament. for $10. And that will defray the cost. You know, we do have to have a police detail to keep everybody safe. It is dark, and um, there's a lot of cars and kids and people, yes. so we have them to keep us safe. And then also and then, an important contributor and partner with us is the Federated Church. Um, and so everyone knows that night there we'll have the, ch the church open. So if anyone needs the restrooms or if it's incredibly cold and someone just needs a break, Warm up. you can um, walk over there and, and take a moment. So okay. we're grateful for that. And they are also hosting our last rehearsal for our band and singers together because oh, wow. we needed a larger oh, right. space than the two separate spaces. So um, we're grateful to them. Oh, good. So Federated Church has also partnered with you. Yes. And you mentioned uh, Norfolk Community League had played a part too. Yes, there are. I mean, they're our main, we're main sponsor. Our main sponsor or partner. Okay. Um, they're covering all the costs for us up front so that we can have the event. So we are Excellent. working together with them. And the Norfolk Lions, we we thank them so much too. They allowed us to sell ornaments both at their Christmas tree sales and at their parade. So oh, there's so many in the community that have made this event what it is. Yeah. Talk about, like, I love that this is a obviously just a, a free, open thing. It's a it's non-for-profit event. Everyone just comes and, and has some um, festive togetherness. And yet the, the main sponsors are other groups like NCL and the Federated Church, which are helping, that are also just community, you know, uh, partners that, that aren't looking, they're just, they're non-for-profits that are just giving back. So it's like right. this nice, this nice um, 
giving back, um, you know, a whole, it's like almost like a circle. <laughs> it is, and <laughs> uh, I would also mention the event, I know it is cold this time of year and it will be dark and a lot of people have little children. Uh, just so you know, it is it is a quick event. It is, oh, yeah. um, if you have plans to do, uh, have a Christmas party invitation or something at seven o'clock, you can get to that. It generally is okay. about, last year we ran about 45 minutes okay. and then everybody could, uh, Go and go do this, yeah. have their plans. Also, Scylla's will be opening that night for oh, uh, right after the event. So if you want to warm up and have um, a drink, have a drink hot chocolate, hot chocolate yeah. or some sweet treats, yeah. they will be uh, ready for us. Okay, good. So Scylla's is opening yeah. too. So starting um, this coming Saturday, December 16th, on the Town Hill in the center of Norfolk, um, we and it's about 5 p.m. and we think that it'll be just by six o'clock. It'll be wrapping. Everybody will be so on their way. Five o'clock start. Um, we welcome Norfolkians, young and old, to come and sing or listen or just be you know just enjoy yes. the, this nice time of year. Um, did we cover all the? And uh, there is a Facebook page, so we just want to mention that. Um, and the Facebook page is called Norfolk Carols. Yep. <laughs> so um, feel free. We'll put that address up for you. Feel free to check out the Facebook page for updates. Um, I think we've covered everything. Um, I think we have. All that is to be done is for you to come and join yes. us and sing. Yeah. <laughs> or listen and just enjoy I the season. Sing. I will sing. Not loud, but I will sing. My kids will not let me sing. <laughs> so this sounds wonderful. And there are some very talented people, the musicians that Lisa mentioned, Lisa being one of them, who she she um, humbly Thank didn't you. mention herself, but she is one of the music leaders. So there's some just beautiful voices and, and instrumentals that we will right. get to get to uh, enjoy. Yes. Um, so see you on Saturday. And that's it. So for um, NCTV, this is Lisa Nope. Um, along with Kay Doyle, one of the organizers of this new, wonderful, town-wide event called Norfolk Carols. And for that, that's our Frequently Asked Questions about it. And thanks for watching. May your days be merry and bright. And let all your Christmases be white.